Hi everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Okay, um, this is a project for the kindergarten class and we are going to be doing Picasso style self-portraits. So what you first want to do is you want to take your pencil, which is going to be your 2B pencil, and you are going to have them draw a line going down the center. And it's probably not going to be that straight, but that's okay. And then going across horizontally. So you should have four quads here, see? Four quads, okay? So how you're going to start this is you're going to take a U shape for the face. So I'm going to just press a little bit firmer so you can see. Okay, so here is the U shape. And then we're going to bring in the neck, which are two parallel lines, and then the shoulders. And they can go off the edge of the paper. You could draw a curved line for the shirt collar. All right, now we're going to bring in the eyebrows. The eyebrows are going to go above this horizontal line. So you're gonna bring one curve, two curves, and then they're going to connect into a nose which goes below the center line. Okay, so this is what we have so far. Then you're going to bring in the eyes. The eyes are going to go above the horizontal line. And then you could bring the U shape for the iris here. And then you're going to bring in the lips. And the lips are an M shape. So here's one M, so it's parallel on both sides. Here's another M, and then a curve for the bottom. All right, now we're gonna bring the ears. The ears are lined with the end of the eyebrow and the bottom of the nose. So they're just one curved line, two curved lines. So now we have the face, okay? Then we're gonna bring in the hairline so they can look at the mirror, decide what type of hair they have, so I'm going to draw one curve line, two curve lines, then I'm gonna bring the top of the hair around to each side of the ear, and then I'm going to draw a little curve line for the bun. All right, so this is how they are going to start. So now you're gonna have them take their 2B, and you're just having them create little horizontal lines in the background. I'm sorry, diagonal lines in the background. Okay, so now here is the background so that when we take off the tape, they'll have an edge. If you want, if they end up pressing harder, that's okay. Okay, so here we go. Now, you are going to have them take their 2B pencil and you're going to have them fill in one of the shapes in the face that are already divided by the horizontal and vertical line. And it can go over the eyebrow, but you're not having it go over the eyeball because we wanna keep the eyeball light. Okay, so now this side here, we're going to press 
harder. So they are going to learn that you can have the same um, gradient as far as in your pencil, as far as the, the darkness of your pencil, and just by pressing harder, it can look like a darker pencil. So they're gonna press a little bit harder here on this bottom part. And they're not going to go over the nose because they'll cover up their line. So they're just going to go around the nose. And around the lips. And just make sure they stay in this box here. They don't go outside of this box. Okay, so now we have these two sides covered. Now we're going to take our Conte pastel and we are going to cover this box here. You're going around the nose and you're going around the lips. I'm not gonna have them use the blending stick. They can use their fingers to blend. I'm gonna have them outline around the nose and around the lips so they can get a close edge here. And then they could just blend with their fingers. Okay, so with this same stick here, you're going to have them go into this top area here. You can have them go over the eyebrow. And then you're going to have them also get their 2B pencil. So now they're blending the two colors. They could go over the nose here. Okay, and then as you can see, so we have the lighter pressure on the pencil, the darker pressure on the pencil, the Conte stick and, or the Conte pencil, and then you're going to blend the Conte pencil and the 2B together. And you could then blend that. They're probably going to get some of the color in the eyes, so just make sure you tell them to erase inside the eyes. And then uh, we are going to darken the eyebrows. So they're gonna darken one eyebrow and darken two eyebrows. And then they're going to darken their iris here. and then they're gonna darken their iris here. You don't have to worry about a pupil. You could just have them darken the iris. And then um, you're going to have them fill in this side for the shirt. And they could also um, fill in the neck here. So they're just repeating what they did here at the top. So this top part here, the lighter pressure on this first part of the neck and the darker pressure on the bottom of the shirt here. And then the same for this one. This is gonna be a mix of the two pencils. So this is the 2B, and you're mixing it with the Conte. And then you're blending. And they're gonna to wanna to blend with their whole hand, so let them know you only 